She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something bad if You'll find her beauty goes much So before we start the video, I do want to shout out Corolla Hat Squad. If you guys do use a discount code that's right here, uh, get a discount on your hoodies. They sell shirts, posters, they sell a bunch of good stuff. They don't, don't only sell it on bronze, they sell it on white, blue, black, midnight gray, all of that. Um, I want to give them a huge shout out for hooking it up. Thank you Corolla Hat Squad for hooking it up. Super fire merch. If you guys want to cop the merch, I will put a link down in the description for their Instagram. Other than that, thank you guys for watching the video. What's up guys? Back with another video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm actually going to be vlogging for the first time. Um, this is kind of a weird sensation. So I have some footage of a previous vlog that I recorded and I didn't really feel comfortable like recording myself. I don't know, like when I put the phone in the air and started recording myself, I just didn't feel right. But right now, when someone's recording me, I feel way better. Like if I put it on a tripod, it, it just feels different. When I when I see people on YouTube when they record their own themselves, I'm like, damn, how do they make it so easy? And I try to do it myself, and I don't know. I it just felt weird. I didn't know like I have it at the right angle. But if someone's recording me, I feel way better. Like I can talk to you guys like normal. So right now I'm headed to the shop and I'm doing the collab with. This is a super cool shop. I'll leave their Instagram. Shop link down in the description so where you guys can purchase this item. So what I have here is kind of like similar to what I'm gonna get, but it's actually gonna be better. It's actually more fancier. Um, the design is super clean. Um, it's our car, so which I absolutely love. The company wants to throw out some like luxurious, more elegant, more um, you know higher tier uh, merch. So this merch is actually a, like I love it. Can't wait to show you guys the merch. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I will be doing a live. They also got another Corolla. I think that is Corolla Nez, if I'm not mistaken. But look at their products, it looks really good. So shout out to Jackie Man. He he came through, you know, I just decided to throw an idea and he was like, yeah, like, why not? Let's go for it. So thank you guys, man. Yeah, I really course. appreciate it though. Yeah, Alright guys, so here is the finished product. We're actually gonna have a shifter band as well. It's gonna be a different design. Hope you guys like it, cause I sure do. I love it, man. So, man, what, what do you got for the company going? What, what, what makes you special, man? So we try to aim for like high-end, premium, like car interior accessories that you know, especially for the Japanese JDM side. Um, we do a lot of custom work. We do a lot of vinyl and merch um, that we're trying to bring into our shop right now. Uh, so keep a lookout for that. But yeah, we do a lot of like these hangers and shifter bands. Um, these kind of shifter bands are kind of, a lot of people are starting to notice it and it's kind of new in kind of the interior accessories. So it kind of just gives it, you know, like that really nice premium notch as well as kind of gives it that nice experience, you know, especially with people that drive and shift and whatnot, gives it that nice feel and the environment in the car, you know. Part of our saying is, um, Kuruzu is spiritually driven, which is what we aim for because what really, you know, we, we, we have a tendency to 
be connected when driving over our cars, you know? So, and that's what we want to help bring in while for, for these accessories. So, kind of help connect the driver with the car a little further with, you know, some of these, these products. All right, cool, man. So that's a little bit of backstory on this company that I actually found on Instagram. I actually found them through Remark. So you actually work with Remark Exhaust, huh? Yeah, so um, we know TK from Remark. Um, he does like all of their uh, promotion and whatnot through Instagram. And uh, we used their car a few times. They used our cars for you know some of their stuff. So we have a pretty good relationship with Remark. We're trying to build a lot of relationships with this, you know, people in general. You know, we, we meet up with a lot of people that come pick up and order from our um, shop. Yeah, we, we try to build like relationships with you know some of our clients and trying to you know bring these different types of stuff. You know, like for example, um, some some um, car teams that they order custom work through us, and all of their teams represent. Um, their brand on a shifter band or a hanger, you know, just to unite the team a little bit more, you know, from there on. So we do stuff like that and we do offer, you know, a little bit of a price break when, when it does come to high end, like higher uh, quantity for those kind of stuff if, mm -hmm. you know, more teams are interested. Awesome. So how much would these run you for? For one, for example, just this hanger, how much so do these run? For original designs, for example, like the koi fish right here, or the cloud right right here, the Oni over there. Those so hangers run for about forty dollars. Okay. Shifter bands run for thirty, and keychains run for about eight dollars. But when it comes to custom work, um, so custom designs and whatnot, we do charge about a six dollar fee, and usually that goes to our website and whatnot. So yeah, custom fees aren't too expensive, and if there if there's already a design that's already made, for example, um, people have a tendency to order, for example, the Team Super 15 one. That one, we won't charge a uh, custom fee because the design is already pre-made. So from there, we can usually try to waive the fee for you. Okay. Yeah. So this one specifically, how much would this run? Something like viewers. this, um, with all the custom work, we're probably here, we're looking about 57 actually. Okay. So um, 46 for the custom hanger and then 11 for the custom keychain. And then, you know, obviously, since you are getting a little bit more from here on out, you know, we're basically gonna waive the custom fee from there. Okay. So, if you guys are interested, the link will be down in the description. I will link the shop and his Instagram. Hope you guys like it. I will be doing an Instagram live. So, if you guys do follow me on Instagram, you guys will get a little sneak peek. Huge shout out to Jackie, man. I appreciate you so much, man. This yeah, is literally like my my thoughts and my brains my you know just stuff that i can't do personally you know you come out here and you did it yourself yeah so i appreciate that man so much yeah it's great working with you as well all right guys so not only do they sell these beautiful hangers and bands they have plenty of other merch that they have they're they're a growing brand yeah so we have stuff from like you know um clothing merch to you know windshield banners we have quite a bit, you know, quite a lot of designs for you to choose from. Uh, we got slap stickers. We got some decals for you. And then here is where you would get the custom work done as well as like rear banners, front banners. So guys, definitely check out their website. They have plenty of things um, that are actually unique. You know, you don't really see these all everywhere. So I hugely recommend you guys to go check out their website. Um, yeah, and I appreciate you coming by, you know, and we, we hope, hope you know, work with you in the future. Yeah, of course. Um, thank you guys for having me. I really appreciate it, man. I've, Super honored to be here and looking at all these crazy designs. So for all the people viewing at home, how do you pronounce your company name? So our company name is called Karuzu. Uh -huh. So it's um, Japanese for cruise, which is, you know, is what we do, you know, yeah. we cruise around in our cars, so that's how it is. Hey, Ogi. Yeah, how are you? Yeah, so look at this, guys. Clean, clean, clean. Yeah, so it has our, you know, banner out the front and then our rear windshield banner as well in the back. So if you 
you guys are looking in the banners, look how it looks here. You got the fitment on point. You got some nice inkies on there. I love the color, man. The color looks good. The wheel combination. Yeah, thank you. So here's the Oni design. Super cool. So what's your, you have a car Instagram? Uh, I do. It's uh, it's pretty basic, but I don't really promote it. Uh -huh. This is a Chewy Jackie. So it's C-H-E-W-Y and then J-C-K-Y. But I don't really promote it. I mean, it's, not, it's just for my own personal stuff, really. So if you guys are interested in, you know, at least following his build or something, make sure you drop a follow. I love his build. It's looking really good. How long? How long? Uh, I had this car for about three and a half years now. Mm -hmm. Um, it is tuned, uh, has a full bolt on, mm -hmm. and it makes about 400 to the wheel. Oh, wow. So now that you said that, let's pop the hood. <laughs> we can, there's nothing special. Uh -huh. um, I, tried to, I tried to make the motor kind of, kind of, what was it? Look kind of stock, honestly. Uh -huh. yeah, engine bay is not, nothing really special, mm -hmm. but it does, does, does pretty well for what it does. So what exactly you got? What performance mods you got on here? So I have a um, Process West uh, Verticooler. I have a UTS intake. I actually am on flex fuel system. So it runs E85. Uh, I have a J-pipe. I have basically all the full bolt-ons. They call it the Stage 3 on the Subarus. And uh, I am tuned by Fat Body. So yeah, it makes on E85, it makes about 405 horsepower on the wheel. Um, the torque is limited due to the internals of the motor. So the torque is limited to, I think, 365, I believe. And it does pretty well for what it is. Cool, man. I love your car. It's super clean, man. Yeah, appreciate it. We run a Porsche Auto pullovers, Ooh. and the wheels are a uh, N key uh, Rajins, uh, 18 by 9.5 plus 38 offset or plus 35 offset actually clean man i like this lip yeah i mean it was a it was kind of a cheaper lip uh -huh. that i got uh, it, especially being that low it's just gonna get chewed up anyway, yeah so. not worth it <laughs> little did i know i was in for a big surprise yeah but damn good clean car man clean car i love it yeah i appreciate it all right guys, so this is the merch. Some of you guys popped up on the Instagram. You guys were able to see it. Here's a little keychain if you guys don't like those beads. It comes in this super nice silk bag with their Kuruzu. So I just honestly, talking to the guy, that guy was super humble, super genuine. I do recommend you guys buy one of these. They're, they're super cool. If you guys like the interior of your car, Probably sounds so bad. Huh. So out with the old. So this is old, but you know, if you guys know, you know, this is still super clean. This is the original one. I actually got passed down to me from Sticky210, if you guys know him on Instagram. No longer has his car, but now, now we're gonna put this beauty on. That. with the carbon interior I'm actually gonna go meet up with my photographer right now Kenny you guys seen him on the channel before looks super clean I hope you guys like it make sure you guys cop one I absolutely love it Plenty different designs if you guys don't want this one. And so this is their business card. If you guys do want to find him, up, I'm gonna put a link down in the description. But if you guys want to find him on Facebook, Instagram, and email, just right there. Look at that how it shines in the sun. Super clean company. Highly recommend. All right, let's go, Kenny. See you there. All right, guys. So coming home from getting the hanger. This is the fourth time it's happened on the freeway, so unlucky.
be a now I actually messed up my bumper ripped off some paint that's actually sucks that's actually bad the other times it would just rip off my lip this time it ripped off part of the lip and now I messed up my whole paint <sighs> my luck my luck but the rest of the lip is fine I'm just really bummed out right here on the freeway uh, let's take a look at that hanger huge shout out to Kenny I really appreciate him he's always taking his time out of his day to take pictures of my car and the products I'll put a link down in the description for his Instagram profile if you guys want to take any pictures with him he's more than happy to he's in the socal area i also want to give a huge huge shout out to karuzu this was such an amazing experience you know something that i never thought that i would go through um please guys i'll put the link down in the description for their website their instagram look how great that looks I also will be doing a giveaway on one of these so all you guys have to do is like and comment what colors would you guys like what colors would you guys be rocking on your car and be subscribed um, this is just another thanks to you guys for watching the channel you know this is a different type of video so what kind of interior colors are you guys rocking because I know I'm rocking red and carbon fiber so that red and black uh, bead really goes well with my interior it just looks so good um, comment down below what kind of colors do you guys have in your interior i've seen a lot of people rock white and blue all black i've also seen some people rock all white but anyways this vlog is just for me going to a photo shoot with some friends from the e210 community um hope you guys enjoy let's get right into the vlog this is six five you like it bro yeah, this is yeah so basically all we're doing is we got some cars out here. Got a little photo shoot going. Got the photographer Kenny over here. That's Frankie and the homie Gabe. Let's get it. So to give you guys some backstory on this cop, um, Gabe actually asked him if he would take a picture in front of our cars just to get some content for our Instagram. Um, the reactions were pretty funny. People thought that we got pulled over or something just for taking some pictures, but. Gabe did ask this cop and he said no originally but then 10 15 minutes later he came back he's like yeah sure why not this cop is super cool he has some funny stories um, he kind of roasted our tint you know talking if it's legal or not but he's one of the cooler cops that I've interacted with and we got the homeboy Gabe right here getting shots <laughs> Like an AMG wagon or like an Audi wagon? Uh, like an Audi. Audi wagon, like yeah. the RS, uh, R6? Yeah, that, and I've always loved the cross country. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Love those. That's fire, yeah. yeah. Good take. <laughs> Yeah, the the, uh, the chippies ride Harleys. We got Brembo's. Uh, LAPD used to ride Harleys, but not anymore. In fact, my girlfriend rides a Harley like, at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, she like... So I was thinking about getting a big brake kit. <laughs> <laughs> you think you let me borrow some of these Brembo's? <laughs> right. <laughs> they are good. Yeah. What's the weirdest call you've ever gotten? <laughs> I'm curious. Uh... If you don't mind me asking. Uh, well, the weirdest call? Yeah. Truck surfer. Truck what? Surfer? Yeah, some guy. Uh, he's got a truck holding something. He's, uh, he, was, he, was, he was on drugs, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he jumped up on top of a pickup truck, one of the security pickup trucks. Oh. And, and uh, so the, the security told him to get down. He wouldn't get down. But they needed to get him out of the area where he was. So they just drove him out like super slow. <laughs> And he was just truck surfing. Wow. Like, uh, you know, Michael J. Fox. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah that was an interesting one. Uh, How long have you been a uh, police officer? 12 years. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, I wanted, I wanted to be a cop at first. And then I gained weight. I was like, oh, good. 
definitely audible, like. It had ten yeah. wheels already. Man, it was a that was a pain in the butt seeing it. Trying to turn, oh, yeah, you gotta yeah, roll yeah. down the window. Yeah. 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 What, what is legal? Ten percent? Uh, I don't know what the legal limit is. Yeah. Um, but if the way I go with it is, if I can see through the car and I can see you and I can yeah. see what's going on in there, mm -hmm. we're okay. Okay. The minute I can't see through the window and I can't see what's going on yeah. like easily, mm -hmm. then that's too dark. Yeah. Makes sense. I will appreciate you coming back. Yeah, yeah of course, don't appreciate work. it. Cool. Really cool. Um, yeah, I think I got everything. All right, cool. You guys have a good day. All, All right. right. Thank you. Stay safe. Thank you. You guys see him across town? Make sure to say what's up. Super cool <laughs> cop. You don't want me to say what's up if I see you across town. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Appreciate it.